Today, we're going to look at your bill counter. Now, a bill counter is a very complex piece of machinery, and any errors with it can be complex as well. But we're going to break down those errors to where you can diagnose the problem and literally fix them within minutes. Let's go ahead and take a look at simple solutions to fixing your bill counter. Hey folks, I'm here to help troubleshoot your bill counter. Now, if a bill gets stuck, the first thing you're going to do is take your bills out of the stack, out of the hopper, clean it out of bills. Then you're gonna turn it around and turn off the power, very simply right there, turn it to the off position. You can also unplug it if, that, if you feel safer doing it that way. But to make sure it's completely powered off, then you're going to just rotate right here by hand. When the bill is able to grab it, pull it out the bottom, and now your bills are unjammed. And next we're going to talk about how to clean your machine. It's actually easier than you'd think. Again, make sure that it's powered off. I've actually pulled the power on it as well. Open up the back door, and you see this little black tab, you're gonna apply a little bit of pressure to pop it down. Inside, you're gonna look for any debris, any pieces of paper, uh, pieces of bills, and then you're just going to wipe down the inside to make sure it's free of debris. Money can be dirty, so you're gonna to wanna to clean it out on occasion. So then just go ahead and push up, even it out on each side, close the back, turn it back around, plug it in, and you're ready to go. Now let me show you how to change the CIS adjustment. Long press menu and then enter the password 9999. Then choose CIS Calibration. Flip it around, open the back, then clean the back by wiping down the inside like I showed you before. Then insert the white laminated paper that's included, close it, and recover the machine. Select Menu, then Refresh, and it'll restart. Now let's see what to do if your hopper is too sensitive. Use the included pen and press the sensor. It's that easy. If your bills are jamming, you may need to adjust the screw to make sure they slide in correctly. Use a bill to see if the screw is too tight or too loose. If it's too tight, the bill won't fit in. If it's too loose, it'll affect the count because too many bills will fit in. It's the standard right to tighten and left to loosen. Should be easy to adjust. I use a coin to adjust mine. You want your banknote to just easily slide in. And it's just that easy. So there you go, folks. Now you have everything you need to know about your machine.